Hello, Dull Bedsit Blogger here, and oh, I've been getting all excited today because I started listening to Burning Man Radio, which is a radio show that is being done from the Burning Man Festival. This is all, oh, and it's had a great mix of music. Uh, I'll put a link in the description bar so you can have a listen as well. Um, yeah, great mix of music. So, um, some sort of like kind of. Uh, Oh, just all sorts. Uh, there was even a bit, they even played some Muslin Gauze, who is one of my favourite... Um, well, Muslin Gauze is very difficult to describe. He's a guy from Man, uh, Manchester who... Was, uh, yeah, if you imagine dub music, OK, proper heavy, heavy bready dub, dub music... But if you imagine dub music that had never been born in Jamaica in the West Indies, but had only been born in the Middle East. It's a bit of a weird concept, but that's probably the best way to describe Muslim Gauze. Fantastic work. Um, I'm not listening to the Burning Man radio at the moment because uh, it's gone off air. Which is a bit disappointing. Which reminds me of a story. Yeah, let's remember a story. I used to dress up as a clown for special school and run around dressed as this really quite scary clown in my uh, blue ballet dancing leotard and these shoes. Yes, that's a big shoe. There aren't many shoes that are bigger than my face. So, uh, yeah, I used to do that, and we were at this club, and uh, I was there, I got ready. There wasn't any changing rooms, but they said, oh, you can change in this, this back room. So I got ready, had everything, I was in the costume, had a couple of drinks, because, you know, I wasn't fully performing, I was just being a bit of a crazy guy in the audience. I'd introduce the band, and they'd have loads of silly string and spray and go mad with a silly string, and just be a bit of a twat, really. And uh, I'd, I'd had a drink. I went to get another one. And uh, walking in there with my shoes, slap, 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 tripped over a plug. And all the electricity went in the building, except for the fridges, I think, for the bars. But, all the, you know, the night was going really well. DJs had great music. All the lights went, music, everything. The uh, night was being streamed live on the internet. That I kicked out as well. And it's like there was some fuming people. Who oh, did this? And it was like there's this bloke dressed as a clown looking really uncomfortable and uh, stuff. Eventually they plugged it all back in and it all got working again. But it was, uh, it was a very uncomfortable moment. So I did go crazy with this spray. And uh, apparently they... They got told off for there being so much silly string stuck to everything and stuff like that. And I think that was possibly, perhaps, maybe the last time I was the clown for special school. Because I was just I was just a, a wild cannon, a loose cannon. That's what the word I was looking for. A loose cannon for those poor, poor guys. And, uh, yeah. So that's my... my clown shoe and uh, internet radio story for you there um, I've, I've only had a few answers on my four lies one truth video so if you click on the annotation somewhere around here that'd be really great put your idea and what you think could be the fact or no, the, the lie and the, what you think could be the truth. And uh, when I get round to it, I'll do a, a video saying, telling the stories behind my facts and fiction. Speak to you later. Bye-bye.